everything's coming to end and I still have to speak. Five minutes, not more than that. The Chancellor and founder, Mr. Shivnarar, Pro-Chancellor Melotra, uh, Vice-Chancellor Ghosh, Guest of Honor, Sir Arun Sareen, uh, Dr. Isha Aluwalia, Distinguished Honorary Doctorate, Lord Charles Powell, Dr. Kasturi Rangan, and Dr. Mike Laurie, members of the Board of Trustees, my eminent colleagues on the dais, proud parents, graduating students, ladies and gentlemen. It's my proud privilege to present a vote of thanks on the fifth and the largest convocation of Shivnata University. Very special thanks to all our guests of honor and honorary doctorate guests for taking time out from their extremely busy schedule to be with us today. Their thought-provoking speeches and word of advice will remain with us and inspire us. Some of you have traveled thousands of miles to be with us here today. Thank you very much for that, and I wish you safe travels to your next destination. I'd like to thank the founder and chancellor of this university, Mr. Shiv Nader, and the trustee, Mrs. Nader, Mrs. Roshni Nader Malhotra, and Mr. Shikhar Malhotra, for their philanthropic work in the field of education. Thank you for your continued support, guidance to the university. I'd like to acknowledge the effort of so many people which went for planning this convocation. To start with, the students who sang the national anthem and the ones who played live music this afternoon. So give them a hand, please. The entire organizing team of this convocation and I can't read all the names, but Anubha Bali, Anand Sherba, General Jay Shankar, Rajesh Dawar, Sudhir Nordial, Anil Nair, Shwet Shailesh Singh, and their respective teams, and all the other staff and faculty volunteers who worked day and night last few weeks to make this convocation a success. Not to forget more than 100 student volunteers. Can you all raise your hands, all the student volunteers, and all the everybody who did that and thank you very much. I would like to acknowledge the academic deans, professors Amber Habib, JP Gupta, Rajiv Kumar, Karthik Krishnan, the controller of examination, and all the faculty and staff members who worked tirelessly to get the results out in time. But for that, you would not be having your degrees today. So thanks a lot for getting the degrees ready. I would like to thank all the guests who came to Shivnara University this Saturday afternoon to be with us. Saturday afternoon is a family time, and to be here at the convocation, really appreciated. Graduating students, how do you feel today with your degrees in hand? <laughs> Relieved, happy, proud. It's a great moment. And my fellow students, especially of Hostel 3C. Hostel 3C, wave hand, that's my hostel, right? That was my first residence in SNU until about a year ago. I still have fond memories of my hostel days in SNU. Yes, I spent five years in Hostel 3C. After we moved to our residence last year, my wife, Kirti, was sitting here. She asked me several times, can we go back to our hostel? And that was so cool. Isn't 3C cool? Hostel 3C, very cool. Let me tell you, when you leave SNU tomorrow, for the last time as a student, you're most welcome to come back as alumni. Your life as a student in SNU would be a history. In time to come, you will remember these years as one of the best years in your life. SNU will become part of you as it is for me. So before you leave, take a lot of pictures, pictures of your hostel, pictures of your roommates, pictures of your friends, and I can bet 20 years from now they will all look so different. So don't miss the opportunity today. We heard from so many speakers, the teachers shape your life. And I want to take this opportunity to acknowledge some of the bright teachers 
who have been my teachers in my life and even in SNU. I'm privileged to have some fantastic teachers in SNU. Professor Dandekar, Professor Tommy, Professor Sain, Professor Gupta, and many others who guided me through my journey in SNU. If you want to succeed in life, get hold of good teacher, and you will sure to succeed. There are three great teachers who have shaped my life, and that's why I stand here. I'm extremely fortunate to have one of my best IIT Kanpur teachers here, uh, Professor Arun Biswas, and those of you, those of you who have taken this class, you know why I'm saying so. Professor Biswas, somewhere here, so thank you, sir. Thank you for being here, and I really appreciate. The second one is my wife Kirti. She's sitting here, and who keeps me cool, disciplined, and in control? I always follow advice, and you know that I can't do anything else. Last but not the least, I want to thank my teacher, mentor, and guide for 45 years, seven months, and 18 days, who has always been a leading light in my life. I am referring to none other than Mr. Shiv Nader. Thank you, Mr. Nader, who has been a deep influence in my life and I stand here because of him. Thank you, sir. I would now like to recognize some very special groups of people here. Would all the parents, grandparents, brothers, sisters, family members of the graduating students please stand? I request you to stand, please. The faculty, staff, and everyone who cares for these graduates, please rise. Graduates, please join me in appreciating these people who have given you vital support during your academic careers. Thank you, and God bless you.